Hello friends, this is tutorial number 16 in this uh, Turbo Pascal programming language tutorials. Ok, in the last tutorial we talked about uh, control statements and we will continue in this tutorial but, and we will do some similar uh, uh, example. We want, to, uh, we want to input numbers and we want to find maximum. But instead of two variables uh, uh, we have, ok, we have x, y and maximum. And in this tutorial we will have uh, x, y, z and maximum and uh, let's start. Ok, first we need that variables x, y and z and of course maximum. And these variables will be an integer. Ok. And uh, let's begin with our application. First we will write write line and uh, enter x, y uh, and uh, z ok semicolon and we need to read the line that variables ok x, y and z ok and we will define a maximum uh, maximum will be equal to x ok we define the maximum but now uh, we will need uh, we will need a control statement we need uh, if for example y uh, uh, by, by default ok uh, uh, maximum will be x but we will see we need to compare it uh, with y and z and if one of these numbers is uh, larger we need to change uh, the variable ok first uh, let's uh, let us uh, let's write if uh, if y is greater or equal than maximum uh, then then what we will gonna do ok we need a uh, begin and end ok semicolon and we want we, we will write if uh, this condition is true uh, uh, maximum will be equal to y okay because y is uh, greater than than the value of uh, e, uh, y is uh, uh, greater than, than than value of the maximum okay uh, y is larger and we will change the the maximum okay and now uh, it will this if statement will be completed because we here we don't have else statement okay uh, if condition is true okay uh, if condition is true uh, uh, if uh, uh, maximum will be equal to y and if condition is not true uh, maximum will stay uh, uh, with x okay now we uh, we will uh, write another if statement and now it will be if uh, z is greater or equal than maximum then we will again we will have begin and end and we will simply write uh, maximum will be equals to z ok uh, the same thing uh, what, uh, as we did with uh, first if statement now uh, we only have a z if z is greater than maximum uh, maximum we will change uh, the, the, the value of maximum and will be equal to uh, variable z ok uh, I am pretty sure that you understand it and now uh, we need we need to write we will write all of these three variables to, to be more readable and uh, we will write a maximum first we will write line uh, variable x but we need a text uh, x will be equals and we need a variable x okay 
the same thing we need for y y equals and we need uh, y okay we will do the same thing for z and we need a maximum okay and we need uh, just uh, uh, to write read a line and and dot okay now we will compile the program to see if everything is all right or we have some error okay we don't have error okay that's great and now we will see if everything works fine okay we enter x y and z okay x will be 30 uh, y will be 20 and z will be 15 uh, let's run okay we have uh okay x is 30 y 20 z is 15 and maximum is 30 which is good okay uh, uh we have this condition maximum is 30 and if y uh, if y is uh, greater or equal than maximum but 20 is not equal uh, uh, or not, uh, not equal or greater the condition is false and we continue uh, will, uh, is 15 greater or equal than 30 it's not and the, the value of maximum is not changed uh, and uh, and uh, we have a maximum is 30 okay we found uh, the maximum of three numbers okay uh, let's let's try again okay we can uh, we can clear to be more readable okay now uh, let's find uh, x will be 6 y will be 2 and z will be uh, 13 okay as you can see now uh, uh we have uh z is the largest number and uh, we we found uh it was uh if uh, uh the last the last condition was true and the variable uh, maximum is changed to 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 13 just let's to to see again okay uh, y it was not greater than, than maximum but uh, z was greater and the, the variable uh, maximum were, were changed and let me see uh, another more example and we will have uh, enter x, y and z okay now uh, x will be 20 uh, y will be 24 and z will be uh, 5 and okay as you can see uh, we have we have okay x is 20 y 24 z equal to 5 and maximum is equals to 24 as you can see uh, uh, just a second we uh we have y is greater than maximum and uh maximum uh, variable maximum was changed to y and if uh, z uh, we have another condition e, uh, just a second if z is equal to y uh it was a 5 and y 24 we is uh, 5 greater or equal to 24 the condition uh, wasn't condition wasn't true and the the variable uh, maximum uh, not changed okay uh, as you can see of course we can we can use uh, two three we can use it with four or five variables it will be it will be the same I wanted to show you and uh, we are progressing okay it, it, it's good now we can enter our numbers and we can we can easily uh, find uh, which number is is uh, largest uh, and okay 
uh, and I'm pretty sure of course you can you can experiment you can practice with with more variables to to just uh, to to get the routine for the for this but I, I I'm sure pretty sure that you will not have you will not have any problems with this okay uh, if you like my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel you can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram uh, and I will see you in the next tutorial